Hey guys, in this video we're going to be checking out the top 5 best CPU cooler in this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion and hours of research and I've listed them based on quality, durability, price, and more. I've included options for every type of consumer, so if you're looking for the best value per dollar or the best product money can buy, we'll have the product for you. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description down below. Okay, so let's get started with the video. Number 1 Arctic Alpine 11 GT Arctic is not a particularly well-known company, seeing as they deal mostly in coolers and some extra accessories. Their Alpine 11 GT CPU cooler is an excellent replacement for the stock Intel cooler, but it won't offer much in terms of performance. It's an overall good low-profile CPU cooler. It is designed to be as quiet as possible, but it does manage to keep your CPU at a slightly lower temperature than the standard cooler can. This is mainly thanks to the heatsink design, which is denser than what you'll see with the stock Intel cooler. All in all, the Alpine 11 GT is not a significant upgrade over the stock Intel cooler. It is roughly the same size, although the bulkier heatsink does help if you want to minimize noise levels. That said, it will not be able to handle any serious overclocking, but considering the low price tag and the limited 6-year warranty offered by Arctic, it is a great option if you're just looking for a substitute for a malfunctioning stock cooler. Number 2 Thermaltake Contact Silent 12 Now, we are slowly entering the territory of the more serious CPU cooling solutions. The Thermaltake Contact Silent 12 is a universal cooler compatible with both the latest Intel and AMD sockets, and also capable of handling some overclocking. It has a large heatsink and multiple aluminum heat pipes, complete with a large contact surface area and a powerful 120mm fan. When compared to AMD's new stock Wraith coolers, the Contact 12 doesn't fare that much better in terms of cooling itself. It keeps the idle temperature slightly lower, although the temperature under heavy load is a tad higher compared to the Wraith. However, this offering from Thermaltake beats the Wraith coolers in one way, noise generation. Namely, the Contact 12 combines a large heatsink with a slower spinning fan, leading to it being much quieter than AMD's latest stock cooler. That said, the Contact Silent 12 will definitely provide an edge over the standard Intel cooler, seeing as it was outperformed by the Wraith at pretty much every turn. All in all, it definitely does live up to its name, and will be a good upgrade for anyone seeking to make their PC quieter, as well as those seeking to up their Intel CPU's clock speed to a degree not possible with the default Intel cooler. Number 3 Cooler Master Hyper 212 EVO and now, for those seeking some serious cooling, we have the Cooler Master Hyper 212 EVO. It is another beefy universal cooler that combines excellent performance with relatively low noise levels, and it even looks good to boot. With the dense aluminum heatsink, four direct contact copper heat pipes, and a powerful 120mm fan, you can rest assured that it will be able to fulfill the needs of all but the most avid of overclockers. The Hyper 212 EVO is among the most popular aftermarket coolers right now, and not without a good reason. It is proven to be capable of outperforming both Intel and AMD stock coolers in every regard, idle temperatures, temperatures under load, and noise generation. However, the improvements over AMD's Wraith cooler are still more limited as compared to the advantages it has over Intel's stock cooler, so keep that in mind if you're considering an upgrade for your stock Wraith. As for Intel users, you'll find that this cooler will simply blow your old stock one out of the water in every department. Number 4 Noctua NHL 9X65 The Noctua NHL 9X65 shifts the focus from sheer performance to compactness. It is a small form factor cooler ideal for the more cramped computer cases, as it takes up very little space compared to other coolers of similar specs and performance. With that said, it has a small and dense aluminum heatsink and copper heat pipes, as well as a rather fast spinning fan to compensate for the former's modest size. If performance and noise aren't above space management on your priority list, then this Noctua cooler might just be the perfect choice. It will fit with just about any configuration, and the performance is still superior to that of Intel's stock coolers. On the other hand, it is a rather pricey cooler, and the appearance of the fan is not doing its aesthetic appeal any favors. But regardless, the NHL 9X65 is built to suit a specific purpose, and it fulfills that purpose admirably. Number 5 Corsair Hydro Series H60 We'll be starting small, with a somewhat basic yet highly reliable liquid cooler from Corsair, the Hydro Series H60. The cooler is equipped with a copper contact plate, while the radiator itself is made of aluminum. 
It is a closed cooling system, meaning that it doesn't need refilling. And finally, the radiator uses a single 120mm fan as a means of heat dissipation. The Hydro Series H60 is by no means the best liquid cooler around, but it is a great entry-level solution when it comes to liquid coolers. If you're upgrading from an air cooler, you will definitely see a temperature drop of as much as 10 degrees Celsius, as well as lower noise levels. There are no glaring issues with the cooler itself, but it does have fierce competition to contend with in this price range. Nonetheless, this Corsair cooler is a tried and true solution, so you have nothing to fear if you decide to go with it. Thanks for watching and I hope you liked the video. If you found the video helpful, please remember to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this in the future. If you have any questions related to these products, you can leave a comment below and I will get back to you as soon as I can.